Jamie Johnson Jr. <laughs> in color on 103.5 WECL. By the way, his latest CD, Guitar Song, now certified gold with little to no uh, radio or yeah. commercial success at all yeah. on singles. People who are just buying the album. Mm -hmm. uh, it's up for album of the year, the ACMs this year. We've been promoting it a lot. We've been, yeah, slightly. I think we. I like to think we have something to do with it. I hope so. You think we have anything to do with that? So, <laughs> I bought it. I'm wondering if because they said they gave him a gold plaque, a big plaque uh, at the Palm in Nashville, yeah. which is you know a real high dollar restaurant. Yeah. And they're used to a lot of stars and stuff being in there. But, but I'm just curious whether Jamie actually showed up yeah he showed up and if he did did he How stay long, long he enough stay? to get That's the plaque right. <laughs> he's been known to show up and hang yeah. around for 10 minutes or so yeah. like somebody else right. we know <laughs> that's, that's enough i'm done he's a he's a he's an honorary old cuss he is man like somebody else we know <laughs> 728 you know, on, uh, on the weasel tv they can see when you point at people oh can they see that <laughs> weasel tv at weasel.com Hey, uh, I got to tell you, I have discovered the secret to me liking food. If you want to open Is there a, a secret? Yes. If you want to open a restaurant that I will come back to once a week, from now on forever, the rest of my life, all it has to do is have the word spot in it, in the name of it. Spot? Spot. spot. Like the taco spot. Oh, not like a dog. No, no, no. Like the <laughs> taco spot. You know, I, I just have, I, I've just fallen in love with the taco spot. Well, I, you said that you could eat there every I day. I could eat there every day. And and uh, it's just a little hole in the wall, mom and pop joint. But I could mm -hmm. eat there every day. Best taco I've ever had. Now we go about once a week, yeah. especially on Saturday because they got those. If like a happy hour from four mm -hmm. to seven, you can get tacos for like two bucks a piece. Now, do you think their tacos would have been any better if their name would have been something else? Could have been. I mean, if they, uh, I I didn't think about that until this past weekend. I went to a place called the Patat Spot. The what? The spot? Patat Spot. It's a it's a little. On George Street, there beside Jack's Cafe. What do they serve? Well, it's it's, it's it's well they do What's exactly the patat. It's a Belgian uh, French fry, really. Oh. The the it's it's like a it's like a European um, cafe because uh, these with well, these Belgian European cut fries and they serve them like the Europeans eat them in these cones, mm -hmm. like um, oh I've seen that like on candy the food cones channel. and. Uh, they give you the toppings that you don't like. We we just put you know put some ketchup on the plate and yeah and dip the. In Europe, they 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 just smother the fries in whatever it is they want to put on them, and and so they give you this thing and then you just load them up if you want uh, curry or you want uh, peanut sauce or you want ketchup or you want onions or you want whatever you just cover them up and they get this little fork, oh and then goodness. you just eat them up. Man, it's just, I mean, it's... its good. So there's a place downtown that serves nothing but French fries? Well, that's half. The other half is uh, they make their living off of something called a, a uh, falafel. You ever had a falafel? I don't think oh, I have. Oh, over in the Philippines. <laughs> well, no, that's a different thing. It, this has no monkey meat in it. This has nothing to do with monkey meat. I was on a married. stick. Yeah. <laughs> I was on a stick. Gary had a falafel before he was married. Yeah. <laughs> I think he paid extra for that. <laughs> no, because I, I didn't know what it was. Eric is the one who introduced me to this. He told me about this. Oh, yeah? And he, he wanted to go down there Saturday night, so we went. And, and a, a falafel is, it looks like a, a, a burned sausage patty is what it looks like. Mm, I'll be honest with you. Sounds delicious. Uh, but, again, this is one of those European things. And you, what you do, they make that thing. It's about that size, and it's, and it's just almost black. And it's inside a, a half a pita, like you would get a, a hero in or something, you know? Gary, you still in? You with me so far? <laughs> I'm going to hang a little bit longer. All right. <laughs> I'm going to have to go to the bathroom. No, no, no. And what, and what it is is spiced. There's no meat involved. They don't sell anything in there that has meat in it. A, fa a falafel is a spiced chick, Mediterranean chickpea mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that they make a patty out of. Oh, and, and then no. they, they deep fry it, apparently, and then mm -hmm. they put it in this pita and then you put you just load it up with toppings i mean whatever you just load this sucker up and then mash it flat so it squishes the falafel mm -hmm. is the falafel the whole thing or is the falafel just the chickpea i think that's what they call the chickpea thing okay and and then you pop it in there and you and you mash it and boy between that and those french fries yeah son it is something else and not and not a bit of uh cholesterol in any of 
I it's it's kidding. all it's all <laughs> what? vegetable. It's all it's all healthy. It's all French fries. Well, besides the French fries, <laughs> and besides the fri- half the menu, and and the fried chickpeas. But other than that, uh, it's. So are you are you going to tell your friends that you grew up in Tennessee with that you had patats and falafels over the weekend? Mm. No, probably not. Because <laughs> I stopped doing you know things along back in the 70s in the 70s they would have understood that right. now now they would question highly i think me going downtown and spending money on patats and falafels yeah but it's called a patat spot it, and that's what they do you there you just go in there and you order and then you just go over to the filling bar and you load that sucker up and mash it and just eat and eat and eat and eat it was so good i had another one i had two of them patats or falafels yes a uh, falafel. Okay. Judy ate half my patats. <laughs> well, you're just bragging now. Truly, <laughs> <laughs> really, go down and try it. Uh, so, so if you want to open a restaurant, just just open anything, something spot, and, and I'll and I'll come eat, and I more than likely will like it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs>